Let's welcome back to some more Persona 3 Reload or last time. We had a giant Persona fuse, fusing session in the fact that we got a really good Persona out of it, but holy crap, it took up more than half of the episode, and I apologize for that. And finished out the rest of the block of Automa. The only thing we have left is the Monad Passage, in which today is going to be that day. We are taking care of the Monad Passage of Automa. I'm taking Yukari, Aegis, and Ken for, well, they're going to just be good for this first one. So, this is going to be... Why am I going up here? This, this is going to be interesting. The end is near. We're going to win. Um. The last Monad Passage. Feels weird that we're at that point, huh? Jeez. Feels weird that we're near the end of the game, but... Then again, there's still the answer, and I haven't even played it. I think I am going to leave that as a blind thing. Oh, hello. Anything in here? No. Okay. This guy is going to be fun. I'm going to do Silvadora. Oh, I need to give you a... This is the first time that I'm considering giving Fuka SP. What has we, what has we as a society become? Let's do it. I am fully de Prepare yourself. We have the hollow turrets. This guy is kind of strange. It's very straightforward. He's a literal tank. Just use Strike, Light, Dark, and Pierce, because this guy will have no weakness in Null Slash and Resist Fire and Ice. It's really just pummel this thing to death. He kind of just uses... I don't know. He, he kind of just does the same thing all the tanks do, which is load up three shells or two shells or whatever and deals damage. So first of all, I'm going to do a Heat Riser... At well, I guess I don't really need to, but I'll do a Heat Riser on Makoto. Forgot we had that. That way, we can start off the fight with Preleia. No crit, but still a lot of damage. Myriad Arrows. Should hopefully dodge that. Oh, yeah, perfect. And load of two bullets. That's just peaching. Okay. We're going to do Masakunda so we can hopefully make that thing miss. And then I think what I'm going to do is... I'm just going to go Haywire. Go maximum firepower. Not bad. All right, Ken, I do realize I never gave him anything to uh, block any dark because he can use dark. I'm going to do him a car card. <laughs> Thank God I kept that. All right, then you, I think I am gonna just set up a charge. Wherever that was, um, where is that? There you are, a suit charge. Cause I wanna try to knock this thing out with just Prey Leia. We have yet to get a crit with that damn thing. Bagon. I don't think my Sarkata's weak to that. No, good. And Makogon. Well, I know Ken blocks that completely, so that's perfect. Three bullets. Okay. Yukari's just going to heal, because I still want to build her Theurgy. If I can, I want to try to conserve our Theurgies from here on out. Hopefully I can do that. Um, okay, I got to make sure. Okay, yeah, Light and Pierce, so don't use... Why did I not have it up here? There we go. This is Null Slash. Okay, it does Null Slash. I'm just going to do Primal Force then. I just want to make sure that I wasn't going to use anything that would just reflect or together. consume. Okay. Um, what do I really do with you? I guess I could use Kogon. You're not resistant to it. Try to do decent damage, too. Yeah, not bad. Okay, now we got the charge set up. Go to Shiva, pray Leia. That's better. Take. Oh, you suck. At least you still have your debuffs. Never mind, you don't have your debuffs anymore. And chart. Oh, you're just really setting up, huh? And four bullets. That's gonna be a lot. Okay. Let's do. Let's do Masakunda. Get that out of the way. And actually, if Ken gets a Spear G here, that'll be perfect for us. Let's do. 
I'm gonna play it on the safe side. We'll do Matarakaja. Uh, yeah, Barakipaja. That's what I meant to say. Oh, uh, you're not getting your theurgy crap. Okay. Um, definitely gonna do a Daikaja on your attack there, bud. Because I do not want you having that. Okay. And then I'm gonna try to go for a crit with Freyleia. Nope. Really showing how great Prey Leia is. Alright, well, at least I blocked that heat wave. Yeah, so Makoto shouldn't be hit that up. much, hopefully. Poison arrow. And you poison thing, you suck. And Prime Force. Ow. Okay. This doesn't just. That's magic attack. Okay. So. That sucks. It's either choosing a heal or choosing... I'd rather just have the heal. Other people who have been hit, too. Ken can survive a poison for a turn or two. I think he'll be fine. Okay. Let's do Matarakaja. For the love of God, I'd hope that Praleia would just crit the damn thing. Um, just do Kogan. Like I said, this really isn't difficult. You just have to be careful. Uh, okay. Do Prelia again. Hit a crit. Unless if this is not a or something. There we go. Jesus. You did Tell you, man. Prelia is good. It's just uh, I'm getting very unlucky. One down, two to go. So money. I actually really need money now. Let's do that and let's do that. Because I'm to be very poor. I am very poor as it is. It's It feels unfair that I could get in so many shots at once. But I guess we shouldn't expect the enemy to fight fair and square. They're doing all they can to take us down. I mean, I guess. I don't know why, though. Uh, return the entrance. We need to swap party members. Well, party member, I should say. We're literally just swapping out Ken for Mitsuru. It's really not that big of a deal. Alright, I'm going to save and heal, and I'll BRB. Now that I've gotten that squared away, um, this one's gonna be more about magic, which is kind of concerning for my end because, uh, well, I don't have a lot of magic. I've been really focusing on into the, uh, ah, the weird physical route. I want to check something though for Yukari. Do I have? I want to see if I just have something. Infrared goggles. Okay, this. If you have the incense box, that's going to be useful for, so for something that I'm wanting to take care of. I'm hoping I can do it this episode, but what does Makoto have? Omega Drive, yeah. Does App Pupil stack on top? Maybe that's why it's screwing me. Yeah, let's give him something else since I don't technically need that. Um, High Counter, Shift Boost Enduring Soul, Pierce Evasion, res uh, Reduce Magic Damage. Actually, I am going to do that. Simply because that will be helpful, and I don't care if it's a butler suit. Uh, I, there will be an episode where I'll go and screw around with all the different outfits, but this is not that episode. We're not that close to the end. Well, I say is we only have less than a week to... Actually, it is a full week to the 31st January in game, but eh, whatever. Opening this. Elegant Bikini. Where's that four out of curiosity? Nobody here. Oh, oh it's, it's for Mitsuru. Ah, okay. Not gonna put that on because it's really weird. <laughs> Heading deeper within. This next boss shouldn't be too bad. I need to do Sylphidora just so I have it. And then I think I'm gonna immediately recover your SP because we are going to need it. So, SP recovery, just give you... I don't want to spam all my precious eggs. We'll just do some chewing souls. Just a couple, not too many. Heading up here. It's a samurai fight. Let's do this. This one's all about magic. We have the Tenjin Musha, Kaiden Musha, Hakuro Musha, and the Onan Musha. Starting off with the Kaiden, Uses fire stuff and is weak to ice, reflects fire and slash. Hakuro uses electric, so it's weak to wind and reflects electric and slash. 
Tengen is, well, uses light, so it has no weaknesses and absorbs light, reflect slash, and strike, and resists pierce. What the hell, man? And finally, the Onin on the right uses dark stuff, so no weaknesses, absorbs ice and wind, reflects dark and strike. So, from the get go, what to do. I have ideas. So, they don't reflect. Okay, that one, res it just resists pierce, but it doesn't reflect it. I have an idea, and my ideas are usually very dangerous. I already, wait, how do I already have that in effect? Huh? Oh, because of the card, that's right. I could start with Prey, I, uh... There we go, show the real power of Shiva. I, of course, I knocked down the two things that would be... God damn it. Okay, um... Screw it. Let's just do... I guess Trickster. We don't have Charger. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, well, now we're just dealing with two. <laughs> okay. Um, right, so no weaknesses. We don't have to... Oh, okay, we just don't... Just don't use... Okay, don't use wind on that guy. That's what I'm trying to get at. Okay. Let's do Garzine. Just trying to take down one of these guys, because knocking down one will save us the this trouble. The um, let's do Marakunda. Yeah, these guys are purely just offensive. They're, they're really not that bad. Vorpal. Don't kill. That's fine. Okay. And then do they... Okay, that's Reflect Strike. That reflects... Oh, okay, they both do that. So I kind of have to choose... I guess just do... No... Let's just do Matara Kaja. Actually, now that I think about it, I should have done Maraki Kaja, but it's fine. Actually, no, we have Silphidara. That's right. Evil Smile, please dodge. Uh, of course, you hit everybody but I guess. Okay. Let's do... Please hit this. Thank you. I know Makoto does all our damage, but I'd rather survive. Okay. Let's do Medi Rahan. Because I don't want these guys to do something really stupid. I mean, stupid in the way that would kill me. Do you get, all right, uh, that one absorbs ice. That one does not. Okay, so the tension I can use ice on. Not bad. Charge. That's kind of concerning. All right, and then I guess for Makoto, I have all those potatoes. Or not the potatoes. The uh, is it? I have Tetracorn. No. Where, where is the thing I'm thinking of? I can't use any of these. Why am I going down here? I made all the... There's a Tarakaja potato. Where was the thing that gave me charge? Ah. Uh, Atrophying Sutra, Sutra, Charged... Okay, here we go. Charged Herb. Give that to... Oh, I can only use it on myself? That's stupid. Really? Okay, that's... That's really strange that I can't do that. Okay, never mind. Not going to do that. I guess I'm just gonna do Primal Force, I think. Do they do... The Onin does not absorb anything like that. It does not reflect... Yeah, okay. Let's just do that to the Onin. If I can knock that thing out, then cool. Okay, cool, that's out. It's just us and you, bud. In which case, what do I wanna do to you? That sounds really bad out of context. What do I wanna, <laughs> what do I wanna hit you with? Um, you have all physical resistances. Just don't use light. So I guess I could do like I don't know, Bufudine or something. Or I can go to the Dude Boy. Yeah, screw it. We'll go with Satan. We'll go with Maggie Dolan. Just, just go against everything I just said. Yeah, this is gonna take a little bit. But it shouldn't be too bad. I gotta remember that you cannot use wind on this thing. So. Shoot, you really can't do much, huh? All right, let's do Master Kakaja. Or no, this is the light one. I could have hit it with, or no, I couldn't. I could hit it with wind. What's That's all I could have hit it with. Time to dust. Just die already. Deathbound. Ah, uh, could be dangerous. Never mind. Okay. And then. Just making sure, yeah, you do just resist that. That's better than nothing. I'm just gonna try to kill it. 
Man, come on! And I just need evasion, blah, 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 I don't care. Just let... Eh, screw it, we'll go with Alice and use, uh, Maggie Dawn, I don't care. <laughs> Easy enough. Oh, so those ones weren't too bad. The next one I'm worried about. We can take Magon. Not really any great ones that I like. I'll, t I'll just take the XP. That helps us out more than anything. But that was tough. The sight of our four, uh, the sight of four samurai in full armor is really intimidating. Did you spot the slight variations in their helms? Maybe, uh, maybe Mr. Ono knows why they're all, they're all different, since history is his field and all. Then again, he might just go on and on and on until the shadows would eventually die from boredom. We should have took <laughs> we should have taken him into this place. Uh, return to the entrance. And for a slight variation, we're just swapping out Mitsuru for Junpei. I'm gonna go heal and do all that. So BRB again. Once you've done all your preparations, get prepared for one of the worst fights in the entire game, and I am not looking forward to it. So, what do I want to have on to begin with? I guess anybody that doesn't have a weakness, huh? That would make the most sense to me. I guess. Sure. We'll just put on Shiva. Um. Use the teleporter, let's head back. So, this is gonna suck. I'm gonna be straightforward with you. This fight sucks. And plus, I love gimmicks in my fights, so this one is also a giant gimmick fight as well. Yo uh, Yohu Buran. Uh, Masa? Who's that for? That's for me. Dark Amp. That could be helpful for something, but I'm going to stick with Excalibur. Excalibur seems really nice. So this boss, make sure you have really good personas and really powerful personas. I'm going to activate Sulfid, because that's just really broken. <laughs> Let's head in. I'm ready. Shadow of the Void. If you remember the Shadow of the Abyss way back in August, you would remember this guy. It's basically a re uh, rematch against him. This guy has no weaknesses and no resistances. Sounds great, right? <sighs> what this guy's gimmick is, he will heal himself 300 HP every turn. They'll also try to use poison and strike. You essentially ha are forced to use a ton of damaging stuff and... You have to do a ton of damage. So, I'm prepared for that, I think. In which case, I'm gonna do... He also uses Dark and I believe just Physical as well. Go Charge. I'm hoping I can get a crit with Preleia. Or at least something with Preleia. You are gonna do Masakunda. We're just gonna spend this turn debuffing the dude. Because this is gonna suck if I don't. Poison Mist. Yeah, he... Heals automatically. It doesn't even take a turn. Oh, you suck! Come on. Okay, okay. You you officially really suck. Just do the Vitai G. The G. I didn't really need to do anything on Junpei's turn, anyways. Matara Kaja. Okay. She got her Theer G. That's perfect. Hit the crit. Yes! Perfect! Pray, Leia! Good damage. Good damage. In a technical sense, this boss is really simple. There's really not much going on with him. It's just the fact that he heals. <laughs> and it's so damn annoying. Um, I think I want Tranquility. I deal with that. Okay. Junpei's Blaze of Life. So there's that. Magardine. Of course you hit Junpei. Please don't do any Marakunda. 
Okay, that's not bad, considering I still just want you to pay the G, so I can just reproc that immediately. It's not horrible. Okay, do I want... Um, I guess I'll just do maximum firepower. Alright, good damage. Again, as long as we're doing more than 300 per turn, I'm not too concerned about it. So, let's go over to... Why do I always forget where you are? Let's charge again. I'm hoping that Junbei gets his Theurgy. So, let's do... Guard Dine, sure. Your Masakunda is going to run out soon, so we'll proc that next turn when we get back. Oh, okay. That's the other gimmick. He will do Diarahan halfway through his HP. So we have to start all over again. All right. Um, do I have? Okay, I do have a defense buff up. Okay. What's next? So what do I want to do? I don't want to use magic because I have concentrate still. I guess I'll just do vile assault. Or I can do vorpal. Let's do vorpal. Hopefully, try to get a crit on him or something. All right. Um. We still have our defense buff. I'll just do Akasha Arts. Hope I can get a multi-hit in there. Nope. All right. Going back to Shiva for Preleia. There's the critical. And Preleia is going to be our saving grace for this. Okay. Ooh, Oracle 2. Let's do Oracle. If I can get a heal off, I can get a free turn out of Ikari. If I get a charge of Concentrate, that'd be really good. Yeah! Okay, don't have to waste a turn getting a charge up again. So let's do Medi Rahan. Try to build up her Theurgy once again. And Accuracy Evasion Revert. Charge. Okay, that's just peachy. Accuracy Evasion Revert. It's fine. I think I might just do... Yeah, screw it. Let's do Blaze of Life. Damn good damage, too. Holy crap. Attack Revert. All right, I need to make sure I have that attack buff. Especially if I'm going to go and spam Praleia again. Alright, let's do Prey Leia. Alright, if we survive this turn... Oh, wait, we still have a turn with Yukari. Please kill it. Please, I don't want to deal with this thing anymore. Yes! I'm pretty sure he can also do Diarahan multiple times. So thankfully that's over. Oh, we still... I never got the... I forgot I never got the Arcana Bursts. Um, oops. Okay. I'll definitely take Star, that is what I wanted, and I'll take Moon. Finally got what I wanted. And Dead Moon Tusk. Okay, that is the item I was referencing a while back. That is something quite important. Oh, hello. Shadow Eliminated. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, we gave one massive ass whooping tonight. Nothing beats the power of friendship. The bond we should all share is stronger than anything. Eh, who am I to talk? Uh, yeah, I guess you got a point there. Especially after all the trouble I caused. But I'm gonna make it up to you. Just you watch. Junpei, uh, Junpei Yori's gonna hit that hit, hit that Grand Slam homer. Oh, come on, dude. Did I kill you to say something like I'm counting on you, bro? No. <laughs> Everybody will just ignore you. Alright, at the very end is a doorway. That's what I'm talking about. I wonder what's in it this time. Avaricious Amulet in the Book of Tav. We can now increase our cards in a day. Huh? There wasn't a tarot card in that one. If we can't open any of the unopened, uh, open, unopened doors, maybe it's best to come back for now. Unopened doors, you say? Like this? The door's tightly sealed. This seems to make the very last door, but it's locked. I wonder if we need something other than tarot cards to unlock it. 
Seems I'm missing something that I need to unlock the door. We're not missing anything, but uh, technically we are. Back outside. Full refresh and everything. That's actually really nice. Teleporter back to the front. And here we are. We, we can at least turn in that request. That requests. Are you accepting a shadow request? of the Void. Let's hear the result. Well done on vanqu uh, vanquishing the Shadow of the Void. That was one of the vilest creatures lurking in the shadows of, Tar uh, of Tartarus. Marvelous. I'm very impressed that you managed to defeat it. Truly. Please take this as a reward. Dead Moon Tusk. That's the second to last one. We will have to go into the real world to get the Tonbokiri. Which, that brings me into something very well. now, I, I guess. Remember when I was saying that this may be your last Tartarus trip? Um, for me, it definitely will not be. There is something special from finishing all of the social links, so there is that bit. Along with that, there's, uh... Well, we have to go outside and get the Tonbakiri. So, what do we want to do for the rest of the night? Well, here's the thing. We still have a request we haven't done, and that's killing the Reaper. Now, the Reaper is no sleaze fest. He is a pain in the ass. Now, granted, you can easily just... Well, set up the difficulty to be really easy and just kill him that way. And I'm not going to try to do that. So, this is what's going to be really difficult. Because, I mean, we're decently leveled. We can kill it. However, there's going to be a lot of things we need to do first. So, let me, let me get all my gear in order and who I want to take. Okay, that's part one of this puzzle that we need to figure out for this. So... What I've done, I've given Makoto and Junpei some new accessories. First of all, Makoto now has the Sacrificial Idol. That will give you Enduring Soul in case if you die. You will f it's very likely that you will die for this. The Reaper is the hardest, just normal enemy you can fight. Junpei has the Phoenix Charm. That also does Enduring Soul, so there's that. Yukari has the Incense Box. Now, the Reaper likes to do ailments here and there. So, if he ends up doing that, we have the incense box. This will make sure that Yukari will always heal from it right off the gate. Along with that, I gave her the insulated tights because I want her to try to dodge weaknesses if she can. And Igus is going full on crit mode. The Reaper is susceptible to crits, so I want to try to capitalize on that. Anyways, other personas I recommend. I wanted to bring Satan, but he does have a weakness, and I don't want to have that stacked. So, just keep that in mind. You do want something with debilitate. We do have debilitate items, so there is that. So, I'm not too worried about that bit, but... Actually, let me see. Do I have, like, a resist wind thing or something? Uh... Mega... That's physical healing. A lot of cards... <laughs> Resist Ice Fire. Oh, we do have a Resist Wind. Do I want to put that on Satan now? I think I do. Simply because you want to be able to pop Debilitate whenever. And I need that. I, I need to have something for that. So, we'll get rid of Growth. We don't need it. There we go. Otherwise, um... This is going to be a little more awkward on my end, uh, considering that we have weaknesses and such. I'm going to save again. And one last bit is we're going back to... It, do, it doesn't matter what floor you go on, but I want to go on a slightly higher floor because I want to farm our Theurgy. At the very least... Well, there's also the Arcana Burst thing, too. I do want to see if we can get an Arcana Burst, so... If we can, that'd be perfect. Now, the Monad Doors do respawn. There is that. The, Mo the Monad Doors Shadow can spotted. respawn. The and there's our Theurgy already. <laughs> Just make sure you don't use a Theurgy and you'll be good. Uh, hello, Dice. Uh, so Death Dice. Yeah, you're scared of me already. I'm just gonna bonk you and kill you. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do... Get ready. Is go through each of the floor, see if a monad door reappears. If it does, then I'm gonna take advantage of it and try to get another card. Either that or just one of those red shadows. Um, there is also these cards too. I highly recommend trying to get one of these support cards before you fight the Reaper. So scramble these three. So yeah, there's a little bit of setup. 
At the very least, if you have your Theurgy on Makoto, that's great. Otherwise, you shouldn't have to worry too much. So, off screen, I'm going to be just going through these fours, see if I can find a Red Shadow or a Monad Door. And, uh, yeah, we'll just go from there. So, oh wait, there's a Red Door right here. I guess I could show that you can, I'm, I'm pretty sure you can resummon these. Pretty sure that is a thing. I've taken down many, many shadows. Oh, you so can't. So. I thought oh, you I could. Know. Okay, never mind. Uh, I'm an idiot. So, okay, only red shadows then. I thought you could fight that, but just keep going through. Now, another thing too is you can go through these floors and random things can happen again, such as dark floors and such. Those can be randomized as well. So just keep that in mind. But anyways, I am... Man, where are the red shadows? I'm like, really trying to get one here. No. Uh, hi, gold hand. I guess I could kill you too, huh? Yeah, uh, where are you, little buddy? Oh, there is also a red shadow. Perfect. Okay. So... There are other personas I would recommend. We're long past. Long past 200 fours, yes. Oh, hello you. I do not miss fighting you. Um, I don't know why I'm even showing this, but I guess I could just do Prey like that. <laughs> Screw it. Well, I'm definitely not getting the uh, card from this. That sucks. That one is so difficult to get the card from. Oh, I did get it. And you got... Uh, okay, sure, strength. I don't care. Uh, deflect. No. Actually, that could be helpful. I'll take the money because I desperately need money. Oh, and I have to get another one because I got an increase to the thing. Okay. Let's well, hopefully I can get it from this uh, gold hand. I don't know why I'm showing all this, but I'll, I'll just meet you guys back when I'm fully set up. Got the card, and actually that's kind of nice. Oh, that took forever because I couldn't, f I couldn't find a stupid red shadow. I was really considering going to like a previous block and just going to a random monad door from there. The queen, charge! Holy crap! Um, deflect. Okay, that's perfect. That's perfectly okay with me. There we go. And we gotta level up on Igus. Perfect. Work, everyone. So another now, thing that you may going. wanna do is try to get Theurgies on everybody. At the very least, I'm gonna try to get Igus and Yukari's Theurgy set. So that is what I'm gonna do real quick. Up oh, there's Yukari's. Okay, bonk. This is pass it to Igus. The only bad thing is Junpei's Theurgy is really awkward to try to get because his relies on crits for the most part. So I guess if you wanted to, you could just bring Karamaru or something, but they already got two of our theurgies. But one other thing is to make sure that you can get a good support card if you can. There's the theurgy. All right, taking that. Because <laughs> now we have the Queen's pop-up in here too and the Joker. I think that's just uh, supposed to be like Joker card because it, uh, whatever. Take these. Now it's not a big deal if you can't get a good support card, but it will help you out in the long run if you can. So, thankfully everybody got their theurgy. I'm going to quickly heal up with Kari. And one last thing I'm gonna do is go to a random floor. This can be whatever floor you wish. I guess I'll just choose this one and fight some of the enemies here just to take care of them. Just see if I, just so I can see if I can get a uh, support card or something. You don't need to have like full max SP or anything like that. You shouldn't have to worry about that. And now that I think about it, I probably should go back and save so I don't have to do all this again. Especially since we got lucky with the Theurgy card. Theurgy is gonna save you a lot for the Reaper. Shelf of time. Uh, that's good. That's perfectly fine. Get money. Get XP. And a quick level up on Trumpeter, because why not? Doing pretty well. Okay. Really quickly, I'm going to go and heal. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, there we go. Return to entrance. 
I'm gonna quickly save and heal and do all that and get prepared for this fight. Now, what I'm gonna say is may maybe contradictive. I'm gonna see if I can kill the Reaper. Now, I have not done this. I've never done this legitimately. Question, well, quote unquote legitimately. There is something that you can quite easily get that will trivialize this fight entirely. <laughs> And I want to try and beat this without doing that. These patterns look so, a bit like if you're gonna, the if you're gonna fight the Reaper, I do suggest waiting later until we can actually get the thing we... Well, well how high a level... I think we can actually get it now. You have to be at a certain level to fuse a certain persona, that being Messiah. Once you have Messiah and... Uh, well, once you have Messiah, things can get really trivial for the, the Reaper, so... I want to at least showcase that you can fight the Reaper without doing all that. So besides all that, if I can fight, uh, win this fight, cool. If not, then I'll show my failure and all that and we'll just go the cheesy route. I just want to at least show how you can attempt to do this legitimately. So, uh, another thing. Uh, that's going to suck that I'm not going to have any charge set up. But actually, no, I, I can't have that. Never mind. So, first things first. We must wait for the guy to appear. How does he appear? Wait on any Tartarus block or Tartarus floor that's not a, I guess, bot that used to be a boss floor or a gatekeeper floor. Any of those are uh, completely fine. So, usually it takes about five minutes, I think. So, I'm gonna sit here and wait for this guy to pop up. So, I'll meet you guys in a sec. Oh, beautiful, it is uh, coming to kill us. We haven't seen this thing spawn yet. And uh, I am still kind of worried that... Here's the thing. The Reaper is more of a fight of surviving more than actually the dealing Reaper damage. So on the map, you can see a bloody red dot coming for us. Now, first things first, you want to get this charged up and smack him. Hello, Reaper. The Reaper has no weaknesses, no resistances. Sounds great in context, right? Well, here's the thing. He does a shit ton of damage. He is extremely powerful, and he gets three turns, well, three moves per turn. So you could, he can easily murder your ass. So what I'm gonna do, I wanna have Shiva on so I can have the agility set, because uh, Satan is really slow. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do I wanna debilitate him right off the gate? Actually, I can set up charge first because we have debilitator sutras and stuff. So I'm gonna set up charge. The biggest thing is setting up. You must have this guy debuffed and yourself buffed at all times. At the very least, make sure that you have a defense buff up at all times and that he is fully nerfed with his attack in, well, I would say attack and evasion at the very least. So, heading down here, I'm gonna go and get this. Is gonna make me, this is making me really nervous. Um, where, where is one? <laughs> Defense attack. Do I not have a debilitator? I, I swear, I, I, I swear, I do have one. I'm pretty sure. I, Defense, wagging, debilitate. Okay, I'm looking right at it, Dur. Okay, doing that. We are just setting up this turn. Now, thankfully, we do have the Reflection right off the gate, so this does give us a freebie on one of his turns. He can also set up Charge or Concentrate, which is really annoying. All right, um, let's set up... I should have done Silver to Aura, because you can set that up as well. Just going to do that. Zeodyne. That should get blocked right off the gate. Yep. Aura just misses. Heat Riser. Double Heat Riser. You are a dick. Four turns! Okay, that's gonna make things interesting. So, how do I wanna handle this? We can't, we could set up Oracle. I need to get a uh, Dikaja set up. Or I can do a, we could do a Dikaja gem and then debilitate. Question is, how do we get Yukari? Actually, we can do a Dekunda. He's not gonna move next. Let's do Dekunda. Okay. 
you are gonna need the debuff. You need debuffs, like, now. So I'm gonna do Tekaja. I think on Makoto's turn, I'll just do the debilitate, so we can just save our items a bit. And then we'll let Aegis attack. Yeah, that's what we'll do. And then once we get a good chance, then we'll uh, just go all out. Debilitate. And I think I am gonna set up Oracle, actually, so we can try to build that up faster. This can take a long time, but as long as you're patient, you should be good. All right, Heat Riser on everybody, that's fine. I'm going straight for maximum firepower. Yeah, he is tanky. Mabufu dying. I think we still have the block. Okay. We reflected something. Evil attack. smile. There's the ailment thing. That's why you want Yukari with the incense. That's fine. That's fine. He only did two, mer uh, two moves that time. Let's do Amarita. So Aegis and Makoto are going to be our main damage dealers. Um, I'm going to say Junpei's Theurgy for if he gets really low. So I think what I'm going to do... What do I want to do? I think Vorpal would do the most here. We get a free turn out of... Or a free hit from him at least. You want to be really careful with how you use your moves though, so... Let's go to... Shiva. Do I want to do a Theurgy or do I want to do... I think Preleia would do more. Higher crit chance too. Because you can crit him. Now, I suggest you're not doing that. Four. One. We have Theurgies. Thankfully, the he uh, the Reaper cannot heal himself, so there is that. Um, I'm gonna do... Let's do Akasha Arts. Damn it. Okay. I, I wish I was doing more damage there. Primal Force on who? Okay, that's not bad. Concentrate. And we're back to our turn. Okay. We're gonna have to heal here. You're gonna lose those debuffs soon. I may do another debilitate as well. Okay. I'm just trying to think about what I want to do here. Let's play it safe and do a Medi Rahan. Okay. You, um... I'm gonna make sure we have a Maraka Kasha set up. The last thing I want to do is have to reproc all that. Okay, you are gonna... Actually, he's still gonna have a... Hold on. I don't remember if he's gonna lose it this turn or next turn. I'm gonna play it safe. I do not want to deal with this guy. Thankfully, he hasn't hit our weaknesses yet, but he very well can soon. Alright, so let's do... Let's do Akasha Arts. I'm gonna hope I can crit or something. Because the saving grace is gonna be critical. Mahamon. That's fine. I'd rather you do that of all things. Survived and restored HP. That's fine. Monkey was sacrificed. I don't think anybody hears me fire. No. Okay. That's fine. That worked out great in our favor. Just keep healing up. Okay, Junpei can get a free hit out of this, so let's do Vorpal. Not bad. You are going to charge. Um, question is, how do I do that without him hitting a weakness? Uh, yeah, no. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to... I'm going to go to Shiva, and then I'm just going to use one of those charge items that I have. Because that's going to be the safest bet right now. Uh, da, 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 where the crap is it? It's up here somewhere. Charge Derb. There's that. I guess it's a tax revert, so we're just going to set that back up. As long as we keep the debilitate up, we should be okay. Do you suck? Oh, you suck. But you might be just doing debuffs and buffs. No, Matsuyo died. Please dodge it, Junpei. Actually, damn it. 
That's bad. There's Zeodyne. Okay. That's not great, but it's not bad. So how do I want to handle this? Because he's shocked. And he goes next to who? Okay, um... I could do all ailments. We would survive. Yeah, the most important thing is getting our buffs and debuffs up, so let's do Amarita. Oh, that does solve down as well. Okay. I can solve the HP issue on Junpei if I do Blaze of Life. Quite problem is we don't have any buffs and debuffs up. No. Maraku Kaja. We need that. We need to have Maraku Kaja up. You can heal everybody. Do I have a healer, though? I should have came with a healer. Uh, Medirahan, you have no weaknesses either. Okay, that solves that issue. Let's, uh, do we have Matara Kaja up? No, we do not. Okay. Let's do Matara Kaja. We're about to get our Theurgies again. Well, Theurgy for Aegis. Please miss! Damn it! It's gonna happen again. Oh, Voodoo. That's fine. Yeah, Homunculus. And Tatarapu. Okay. That's fine because if I or if Makari gets back up, she'll be okay. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're good on that. Amarita Shower, get rid of the confusion. Which honestly, confusion's not that bad, but I do not want to deal with it. Okay. Here, here what are we gonna do? Probably just Vile Assault. Hope for a crit, maybe? No, okay. As long as we're dealing damage, we're fine. I need to set up the Debilitate again, so back to Satan for Debilitate. As long as we have this up, we are okay. That's the most important bit of this entire thing. Okay. And then... God, what do I want to do here? I could do a soft heal. I think, I, I think I'll be okay if I do an Akasha Arts, even if he does Maziodine again. I should be able to live it. Dekaja... Still have a chance to dodge it. I kind of need, I, I need Oracle back. Please dodge it. You are lower evasion. You've been landing that every single time. You suck. Come on. That's fine. Alright, yeah. Because we have so many homunculi. Okay. We need to do... I can heal with Makoto, so... Let's do Amaretta. Get rid of the shock. Like I said, this draws out a lot of time. Alright. You, um... I'm gonna heal anyway, so I might as well just attack. Actually, no. No, we need Maraku Kaja. That's the most important bit of this. Make sure that's up. Alright. Makoto can heal, so we'll go back to Koryu. Once we get Theurgy back on Aegis, things will look a little better. It's just right now we're kind of stuck. We can keep ourselves alive. It's just getting rid of this jackass. Heat Riser. Are you just doing that twice? Debilitate on who? Makoto. Okay. So we're going to have to debilitate on Makoto's turn. Is he charged? Nope, not the Reaper. He is charged. Okay. I can do a Dekunda. I have to do this. Could do a Dekunda. I could also attack. Because we do have our buff set up. I think I have Heat Riser on Makoto though, don't I? Uh I thought I or no, wait. Oh crap, it's only going through that. Never mind. Okay. I think I'm gonna just attack here. Uh, I could do this. This is gonna... Yeah, this is better. Tranquility. I'd rather deal more damage in general than just one massive hit. Plus, she's not even concentrated. I like to have options. Okay. So I could do Blaze of Life. I don't really want to do that. Let's do the Dekaja gem... Or Deka yeah, not Dekaja. Dekunda. Um, where is that? Where is that? Dekunda... Which really didn't do much. Okay. Never mind. Right, you, you did a heat riser, so we must debilitate you. There's no if, ends, or buts. Satan. 
Hopefully once I get my gear back, it'll be a little better. Like I said, this lasts a long time. It takes forever to kill this guy. All right, we do have an attack. Um, it's going to make most sense if I do maximum firepower. We have charge plus attack up. Plus it's, he's nerfed. It makes the most sense. Uh, this is dragging on. Maragi dying. Nobody's weak to that, I don't think. Yeah, nobody's weak to that. Evil smile. That's fine, because Yukari can heal it. Only Junpei got hit by that. Okay. So we still have another turn of this before we have to do it again. Let's do Amarita. And then I think I'm just going to reproc our defense, because we need that on Makoto more than anything. Just to play it safe. Our attack is fine. I think I'm going to hit this thing with a Prey Leia. Yeah, I got a crit. Perfect. Good damage. Good damage. Back off. Um, Who's next? What to do? I do. I want to do this again. It's a risky move, but I could. Screw it. We play riskily. Damn it. Okay. Well, so much risky business. Okay. Um. That thing goes next. Let's do. Let's just do a full re. Just do a full heal. I'm not risking anything. We do still have a concentrate on uh, Makoto as well. So if we get the Trickster, we could do that. Magarudine. Junpei goes down. Come on. That's fine. I don't really care about that. Homunculus monkey sacked itself. Matsuyo, damn it. I knew you were going to do that. Please dodge it. Okay, that's actually kind of bad that you dodged it. Or no, Buffy died. I resist that. Okay, dizziness plus down. Okay. I have to do Rita. But I think in this case, I'm going to do Blaze of Life. Oh my god, we did it. Ah, I have never done this. This was all on... I was just winging it. Oh boy, okay. Your reward for killing the Reaper is a lot. Ooh, Dark Camp, hell yeah. Definitely grab the XP and the money, because... 300,000 XP. We are in the level 90s now. <laughs> Oh boy! Oh, finally got Allied Ants on you. That would have been nice. Um, get rid of Invig. We don't need it. Oh yes, and got your Destroyer's Drums. That's the Reaper. You also get the item from him for, well, for Elizabeth's request. Oh hi, Gold Hand. I really do not need you right now. <laughs> get the hell out of here. Ah, uh, okay. Like I said, though, like, the Reaper's not horrible. I find him easier in this... After doing that, he's definitely easier in this game than he was in P5. In P5, he had to have him ambush you, uh, unlike in this game. Good day. I want to Are give you, you my spoils. Let's hear the result. I see you've acquired a bloody button, which means you've managed to defeat the Reaper. That's quite a feat. Marvelous. You are approaching the level of strength I hoped you would achieve. I have waited for so very long in this room where time has no meaning. You may be the one to help me answer the question that has confounded me. How Please excuse me. That completes this request. Divine Pillar. And take out the ultimate adversary. Marvelous. None can deny your power. Not after you defeated the Reaper in battle. Thus, we have arranged a battle with an opponent befitting your caliber. The ultimate adversary, so to speak. I believe you are familiar with the depths, correct? At, at its end lies the deepest point of Tartarus. Please head there to face this challenge. Alone. I will await a that is a gonna success. be a bit before we take care of that. That is the hardest fight in the entire game. Yes, harder than the Reaper. I... Oh, that's gonna be a preparation and a half. Very but yeah. Well. The Reaper serves as the best XP farming enemy in the entire game. This is the same with all the other games. We have level 90 on our belts. And here's the thing. 
while we could just keep doing this whole Prey Leia thing and all that, I mostly wanted level 90 for something specific. And that something specific is what we're going to take care of next episode. So, next time on Persona 3 Reload, we're going to have some pretty powerful shit on us. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. Thank you.